Hey there, Internet. So today I'm doing an unboxing video for this SSD company called Asura. It's called the Asura Genesis Extreme. And I assure you, you will love this product. I met with this company back in Vegas at CES, and they showed me just how fast it is. And so I'm super excited to be testing this out and uh, that they sent it to me. Um, you can see they also sent this nice little mouse pad with it. Now, there are a lot of technical details and specs about this SSD. I'm going to link to it, uh, a Google Drive document uh, below this video. So if you're really interested to see the comparison with other things in the market, you can click that and check it out. Performance refined. Genesis Extreme. One terabyte. Some nice samples they have of it. And here it is. That looks pretty extreme. So you take it out. It's also very colorful. Wow. So I'm here with my buddy, Mike Hove. We're doing a little bit of uh, computer tech update. I have this really cool Asura one terabyte solid state drive. We're going to be installing into my PC. Uh, it's a PCIe 3 NVMe uh, SSD. I know that's a mouthful, but uh, means it's pretty quick. Uh, it supposedly has sequential read speeds up to 35 megabytes per second and write speeds up to 3000 megabytes per second on the sequential it's pretty quick so it's a lot faster than most it's, other transferring if the files. speed if these speeds are correct when you test them that like from what they're saying then this should be the fastest one on the market right now and it's got rgb leds it lights up huh yeah it does sweet um, so it says, you know, if you don't have enough space on your motherboard for the Genesis Extreme, our module design allows you to remove the bottom heat sink and then two side LED diffusers for better fit. So even if we don't want the LEDs on there, like it might be too bright, I already feel like at night I can see this thing in the bedroom lighting up. So I, mean, I don't know. Do you think I should keep the LEDs in there? Yeah, why not? Depending on your motherboard, where your M2 uh, slots are, will differ on this board it's right here um and to install it it just lines up just make sure you uh put the corresponding uh, nut that comes with your motherboard to install the ssd uh so on this one it's uh it's the third it's the third slot it's the first slot actually right there cool and then it just it's lit just slides on just slides on just pops in Oh my, I can't seem to... Okay, here. There we go. It's literally just kind of slides on and bam. bam. And then you just take... Just like that. <laughs> it's just as easy as doing that. And you just take your screwdriver. First right. try, first try, first try. We're about to turn it on. It's going to light up. It's going to be the rainbow colored one. That's pretty crazy. <gasps> Whoa, it's so colorful. Oh wow, look at that. So that's one terabyte. Yeah, it's one terabyte. Sick. Sweet. All right, so I'm going to end the video there. Thank you guys so much for watching. Check out Mike on Instagram at Hove Photography. Yeah, H-O-V-H-A Photography. Check it out. Really cool photography, aerial stuff, drones. I hope I earned your subscription today. If so, hit that notification button as well so you can stay up to date on the latest video, the latest tech. If you have any questions about this, write a comment below and we'll get back to you. Have a great day.